Shalom, Israel. I want to give all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Raka, Kodash. Double honors to the apostles and elders who teach and rule well at Great Millstone. And peace and salutations and peace and mercy to the prophets, the hopeful elect, the 144,000, and to the men and women of the 12 lost tribes of Israel, you so called Negroes, Latinos, and Native American Indians. Shalom. Back with another lesson. I'm Yashar Allah 144. Um, I'll title this one They Who Refuse to Obey the Gospel. They who refuse to 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 obey the gospel call halal yahweh bahashim yahweh shai call halal yimla abanawa yahweh bahashim yahweh shai and at, you know back with another lesson and, and, and through the spirit man and as as the title reads you know uh they who refuse to obey the gospel you know um there's there's a great deal of uh punishment that's coming to those that, that rejected the, uh, and refused to obey the Lord's word. See? There's a great deal of punishment coming to those that refused and rejected the Lord's word, man. We're, 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 in, the, we're in the last days, the latter end. This is where the Lord going to get you. This is where he finna get you at in the end. And the Lord told you too in scripture, uh, uh, what he say in scripture? He said, uh, uh, those that uh, that don't want to hear uh, uh, this word, your prayers are abomination unto him, unto him. So, you know, you don't want to, you don't want to hear this word. You don't even don't even pray to me your prayers I reject because you don't want to hear my word and and here we are you know um, our people man you know uh, the tribes you Israelites you know it's it's all about having a good time this is what this is about it's all about having a good time there's nothing wrong with having a good time but you know, uh, um, our people take it too far. We're, we, you know, the Lord told you to pray and watch. We, we're in the end here, man. Everything is changing and time is speeding up. This is a grace period, man. The Lord has laid out all the resources for him, for, for Jake. All You have all the resources to come and seek and find the Lord. He has set up his men out of his people, the prophets, the teachers. But a good majority of our people, they, they want to have a good time 24-7. And they're not paying attention to the signs on what's coming. The wolf is coming. Hmm? You know, uh, uh, we see, um, you, know, uh, the, you know, the governments are completely... Um, they're corrupted, man. All of them. Ultimately, this one here in America, it, it's completely divided. The Lord told you uh, uh, a house that's divided cannot stand. So we're witnessing the American government that's about to crumble. And then, uh, 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 you know, the people are just waxing worse. They're waxing worse. The perversion, the idolatry, you know, the lust. And then, um, you know, uh, uh, um, war is on, is on the way. War. Um, but let me go here. I don't want to make this too long. Just a quick hit. Proverbs. Proverbs 1. And I'll go here. Proverbs 1 and 24. Proverbs 1 and 24. And it reads... It says, because I have called and ye refused. See, because I have called and ye refused, I have stretched out my hand and no man regarded. The Lord has called and he's calling. This is a grace period. The Lord is showing mercy by you. It, you have, it's easy 
to 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 uh, um, to seek the Lord to find His Word. The Lord has set up the internet ultimately because this is where ultimately His Word is going out uh, uh, on the unicorn. The unicorn. Internet is the unicorn. The Lord has set this up because the internet goes into every single place on earth. You see. He said, this gospel must be preached into every single nation on earth. And look how long this word is going out, man. The Lord says, because I have called, he has called and called and called. He's still calling. He is, he, you know, uh, 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 <laughs> He's he's blowing. He's the, the the lines are being blown up twenty four seven. He is calling. His word is going out, and it's going out heavy amongst his people, amongst the northern and southern kingdom. This word is going out. It ain't no excuse. He's not gonna leave no excuse because I have called and he refused. I have stretched out my hand and no man regarded. It says 25, it says, but ye have set not all my counsel and with none of my reproof, you have rejected and, uh, uh, um, and ignored my, you know, my word, Jake, this is what he's saying. You've ignored the Lord. How long are you going to continue to ignore him? But what do he say? I... I also will laugh at your calamity. I will mock when your fear cometh. Let me go here. He said he's going to laugh at your calamity. He said, I will mock when your fear cometh. The wolf is coming. So let's go here. Because this, this is the period of time that we're at. We're, this is where we're at right now. Revelation 6. This, this 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 is where we at revelation 6 and 4 revelation 6 and 4 it says it says and there went out an, a, another horse and there went out another horse that was red huh and revelation means uh uh, uh, uh to uh, revealed so th this is this is about to happen it says and there went out another horse that was red and power, huh? And power was given to him that sat thereon to take peace from the earth. See, and he saw Edom, the devil, the so-called white man, is in rulership right now. And and power is given uh, is is given to him. And and uh, the Lord, like he said, he's gonna uh, um, give the uh, uh, sword into the hand of the slayer. And Esau is about to bring a, a, a total draconian, um, dystopian. You're about to lose your rights. Esau is bringing in his his B system. It ain't gonna go all the way through because the Lord gonna let him go so far and then shut him down. But it's gonna he this this B system is going is ultimately to uh, uh, bring judgment. On, on, on two thirds of his people that refuse to obey the gospel and, and judgment on the other nations. Power was given to him that sat thereon to take peace from the earth and that they should kill one another. War. You have World War Three coming, you have civil war coming, civil unrest. Your residentials, your you know, uh, uh, your schools, your your businesses, your you know, uh, grocery stores are going to be set on fire. There's going to be uh, martial law. There's going to be uh, 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 you know, um, just you know, destruction going on, chaos in the streets, man. This is what's coming: pestilence, diseases, famines. Total lawlessness. We're heading into the worst time that, that the earth has ever seen. Ever. And ultimately that, that world war, that nuclear war. But you're about to lose, you, you're about to be stripped from your rights, man. And, and right along with that, that RFID. 
the micro C here. This is what's coming where no man can buy or sell. This is what's coming. You're going to be stripped from your old life. From your old life. And there's going to be a new way of living. And there's going to be two options. You're either going to, you're either going to obey the Lord or you're going to obey the devil. And there went out another horse that was red and power was given to him that sat thereon to take peace from the earth and that they should kill one another. War. World War Three is coming and civil war is coming and everything else, all the chaos and, and violence and destruction that's coming, natural disasters, all of that. It says, and there was given unto him a great sword. Hmm? It was given unto him a great sword. Esau is bringing out all the uh, AI technology, all his weaponry. He he wants he wants uh, uh, violence. He wants chaos, so he can bring in his B system and into uh, um, you know uh, to, to take your rights away. This is what's coming. And, 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 and to dare Jake, to dare you to try to get physical and carnal with him, because he he bringing in his his military right along with his AI weaponry, the sword. He was blessed with the sword. Let me go here. So this, this is what's coming. Let me go to Second Thessalonians. I'll close out with this. I'll close out with this. Call Allah Yahweh Shemel Shai. That's the, that's where we at right now. Revelation the sixth chapter. Uh, Second Thessalonians. Um, Second Thessalonians. Um, two. Second. Second Thessalonians one and I'll go to six. I'll, I'll close out with these last few. Second Thessalonians one and six. It says. It says. Um, seeing it is a righteous thing. See, seeing it is a righteous thing with the Lord to recompense tribulation to them that are that that trouble you, the persecution. The Lord said He's going to recompense those that are persecuted for uh, for for His name. The Lord will make a way for His elect, the believe the, the true believers on Yahweh Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai. You will have to have those names, the true believers. You see, that obeyed the gospel, that believed what the prophets were telling them. Th this is who's going to be delivered in the end here, man. The men, the women that, that believed on Yahweh Baha Shem Yahweh Shai and obeyed the gospel. Seeing it is a righteous thing with the Lord to recompense tribulation to them that trouble you. Seven. It says, and to you who are troubled, rest with us. The Lord is, he, he, there's mighty miracles coming for, for the Lord's uh, uh, elect, man. For his, for his uh, 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 servants. There's, there's mighty, the Lord is going to protect you and make a way in this end. For the chosen, the remnant out of his people. And, and to you who are troubled, rest with us. When the Lord Yahweh Shai shall be revealed from heaven with his mighty angels, the Lord is coming back with innumerable amount of angels. In this end here, and he even told you uh, 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 in this end, because the time is going to be so bad that Michael the archangel is coming back to stand up for his uh, remnant, because it's going to be that it's going to be that bad. It's going to be a it's no holes bar out here, man. A straight jungle. It says eight. It says in flaming fire taking vengeance on them. In, in flaming fire taking vengeance on them that know not the Lord that and that and that obey not the gospel of our Lord Yahweh Shemel and Shai. This is the point right here. Nine. I'll close out with this. Nine. It says, Who shall be punished? Who shall be punished? See, the Lord has the, the He has the uh, power to torment you in the flesh and to torment you in the spirit. See? He can tor torment you while you're alive, and then when you when you put to death, he can torment you after that too. 
but there's punishment coming to, to, to a good majority of our people uh, 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 that, that rejected and refused it, the Lord's word. It says, who shall be punished? Hmm? Punished with everlasting destruction from the presence of the Lord and from the glory of his power. Shalom.